The goal is very simple. We want to train the very best thoracic surgeons we can. We're going to insist that you're involved academically, that you critically read papers, you critically do things uh, from an academic standpoint. And if you want to do papers or get in the lab, we will find you opportunities. I was looking for a program where I'd be able to find mentorship, good opportunities in operative skills. The operative experience here is also excellent. And when I when I interviewed, I learned really what that meant. You know, our residents from the beginning are, are participating in surgeries, doing sternotomies, doing lung transplants, and I knew that, that was something I really wanted from the beginning. But even in addition to just the operative experience, the perioperative experience is great as well. We have a lot of responsibility with our patients, and we learn both the operative and the uh, perioperative management of these patients. Um, and then just the collegiality, our team's great. Uh, we have a lot of fun together, um, and I'm really thankful for all of them. We're proud of the program, proud of the training our residents get. It's not a spectator sport here. We do a lot of bypasses, still do a number of valves, uh, very involved with lobectomies and esophagectomies. In fact, most of our graduates would uh, meet the requirements for the thoracic track, as well as the cardiothoracic track in the Board of Thoracic Surgery. We teach you how to operate. The most inspirational moment I've had personally was not so much as a provider, but as a family member. My father-in-law on last Labor Day had a ST elevation MI and was taken to the cath lab pretty emergently after presenting to the emergency room. After seeing him in the cath lab, I called uh, everybody I know, including Dr. Carpenter and Dr. Cordova, and they promptly took him to the operating room while he was in cardiogenic shock. Seeing it from his point of view and as a family member, of something that I do on a routine basis and seeing his recovery and his progress over what would have otherwise been a life-threatening emergency is very inspiring to me. One of the most inspiring moments at UT Health San Antonio was when I went on my first lung transplant procurement. As a person who really loves the heart and the lungs and all of that anatomy, the first time that you see the lungs go from in a patient that is a donor and off into a table to be prepared to go on the procurement, you see them blow up all the way. You know, and I think just that anatomy is so incredible the first time you see it. I like San Antonio as a city because I come from up north and from North Dakota. Uh, it doesn't snow here very often. The weather is always beautiful. The people are very nice. I like it as a city because I grew up in a kind of a smaller town, but it's a very large city. But in most places, it feels like, you know, not a very congested area. So this actually is a very good uh, mix for me in terms of having a big city without having the hustle and bustle. The city has a great environment um, in terms of it has great weather as well. Um, I personally like the heat, so even the three months of the summer, um, I think are manageable, but typically the other nine months are uh, like perfect temperature. But otherwise, it's, it's really been an easy, easy city to adapt to. San Antonio is a city with lots of backgrounds, lots of socioeconomic classes, and to also work with people who come from all of those different types of backgrounds really provides you with the opportunity to know what it's like. Um, and being at a medical school that supports that, I think just means opportunity for you now and then in the future. It's been a joy leading the department, uh, and I enjoy leading it because it helps uh, give me a vantage to improve what we do. The best leaders are those who recruit good people and stay out of their way. And that's something I'm trying to learn to do and we'll try and teach you to do if we're lucky enough to have you come and join us. So please think about San Antonio. We're uh, thrilled that you're considering us uh, and feel free to get in touch with me for specific questions. Thank you.